What is going on you guys? Hope you're having a great Friday. This video is going to be part of my foundational series like I talked about in a different video where I just try to give videos that kind of help people that are beginning or maybe people that have begun a little bit but want to take it a step further. So today it's going to be a super short video and I'm going to show you basically how to back up and encrypt your wallet for, for the most part. It doesn't matter which coin that you're involved in but they're all typically about the same. Today, just I'm just use Go Buy as an example. I mine Go Buy it because it's a decent pros profitability, and um, so I just have this wallet open. So let's go ahead and dive on into it. So backing up your wallet, for the most part, almost all wallets are about the same. All you got to do is go up to File, literally click Backup Wallet, and then right in here, just pick where you want to save it. I'm just going to pick Desktop for this example. And what I like to do personally is I like to um, label the wallet so I know moving forward you know which coin it is and what the date is so for this example since it's called go by I might label it go by I would say today's the you know February 16th 2018 and I would label something like this you're gonna hit save I saved it to my desktop so you can see right here that's your that's it it's that simple also what I do suggest is when you back it up obviously you don't want to keep it on the computer you saved it on because if that computer crashes it's kind of pointless you not only lose your original wallet but you lose the backup that really doesn't make sense so take this file this dot dat file and make sure you put it somewhere else safe uh, I have been told and I don't specifically understand why but I have been told that the flash drives do not hold memory for years and years to come so be careful with that um, you know maybe do I do multiple backups so you know I, I'm gonna I, I'm going to do multiple downloads. I'm going to put it on multiple places. So I'm probably protected. But just make sure you're safe with your stuff because it is a decent amount of money over time. The last thing I'm going to show you how to do, and again, I told you this video is quick because it's not that complicated. I'm going to show you how to encrypt your wallet. So again, most wallets are about the same. Some are a little bit different. But for the most part, either under File or Settings, you're going to find up here where it says Encrypt Wallet. You click that. It's going to say in here, New Passphrase. You're going to put in a passphrase and repeat it, but it's just like all your other passwords. You have to keep that passphrase someplace safe. If you lose it, you're kind of screwed. Once it's encrypted, down here typically you'll see a little uh, icon or logo that's kind of like a little lock, and you'll know then at that point that it's been encrypted. At that point, usually you have to re-back up your wallet for whatever reason. I don't know why that is, but this one is almost pointless at that point, and you'll have to re-back it up. If you cannot find an ability to back up your wallet within uh, you know, this interface itself, for whatever reason, you're going to go to oh, it's this window here. So in your actual local hard drive, you're going to go to some place like this. It's going to be typically, typically your C drive, users, the name of your actual uh, computer, so mine's called Chuck's laptop, app data, roaming and then you're gonna find the name of the coin so again for this example we're using go byte so it's under go byte folder and then right here that file right there that's the file you want to copy I don't know if I need to shut this down first to actually copy this over I would imagine just for safety measure shut down your wallet copy this you know paste it somewhere else and rename it again I always like to rename it with the coin name and the date I do it so I know moving forward when I make multiple uh, backups I know which one is at which point if it's encrypted I also put in there you know crypt up, cri encrypted backup so it, that's it there's really not much more to say on how to download or how to backup and encrypt your wallet but it is something extremely important to do some wallets uh, you know are just a basic simple where it's a password the wallets that you know you need to actually pull it off the file off and back and, and uh, back up that's how you do it so really no other reason to make this video longer than it needs to be if you liked that video and it helped you out awesome give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you disliked it and you didn't learn anything from it please give me a thumbs down and let me know what you prefer to see rather than what I just showed you so thanks guys hope you have a great day